Hey everyone, and welcome back to episode 73 of Terraria 1.3. Last episode, we discovered that gem spark walls, topaz gem spark walls anyway, they don't really work here. The goal was to use them to kind of complement the gold walls, gold brick walls in the background of my safe. And that didn't, didn't work at all. <laughs> it did not work at all. We kind of mapped out the rest of the side of the house. Now what we need to do is figure out how I'm handling my roof, what we're going to do, with the roof, I do not know. See, previously, what I did is I kind of had just a squared off roof with NPC houses. But a lot of people want me to make NPC houses, like, individualized. I, I might do that. I, I might not. For now, what I'll do is let me just build up. So let me just continue this pattern. This is shaping up to be very similar to my old house. And I, honestly, at this point, I'm okay with it. I really did like my old house. I don't need to go too much higher that so what I'm gonna do let me just build over and then I will consider maybe making NPC rooms here as temporary and then we can clear it out and make it storage I don't know I mean I'm not worried about the NPCs before hard mode they can stay down there and <laughs> if they die they die that's fine the the real the real problem is I just want to get the hard mode so I can get some of the cool crafting ingredients that is for shizzle and let me go ahead and just do this all right, so we're getting a, we're getting a layout here. We're gonna need to go get more glass, well, sand and then glass, so I can finish all these gem spark walls off. I'm kind of sad that I I ran out there. I blame the topaz. Is there any way to take it back? I I don't think I can reverse craft it at all, which kind of sucks. So normally what I would have done is put little NPC houses up here, like small compartmentalized rooms, and then you can access them as need be. But I think I'm gonna hold off on that one. Let's prioritize the black paint again and take the paint sprayer. I'm going to go ahead and make some more boreal wood walls. Go over to my crafting bench. And how many how many boreal wood? I have 300 boreal wood blocks. Let's do that for now. So smart cursor it up. And this is going to give me an idea of what this is going to look like. My god, why are there so many slimes in my house? What is going on? See, it'd be a good idea to bring the NPCs to my house because they would clean up the trash that spawns like that. You know, the occasional slime? I mean, look, there's another one. They just keep spawning. It'd probably be a good idea to bring them here. I think I might end up doing that. Uh, some NPCs I think will give fancy houses. Like the Dryad, she's a pretty unique NPC. Maybe... Oh, what's his name? Maybe the Goblin Tinker. Or the Steam, Steampunker could be really cool, because she could have a really neat house. Because she is, like, all mechanical-themed. There's a lot to work with there. But I think I might end up actually just putting those compartmentalized NPC houses here. I, I think that would be a good idea. So we're already almost out of walls. That's crazy. That's crazy. I just had 600 a minute ago. Let's connect these at least. Okay. So I need to paint these walls before I forget. And just do this. So these, these were here before. Okay, we're good there. Let's continue to spam the walls. We don't have much left. Grapple, grapple, grapple. That's what the difference. We're good. We're good. I'm going to be lazy just sit here. 72 is all I have left. And we're just about out of walls. How much paint do I have? 120 in the stack. So we're out of walls. I used 600 and I, I barely made a scratch. That's nuts. So we need, we need more white torches. That's been decided. We need diamonds. So when I go mining a lot, the hope is honestly to find slush and find silt and extractinate it. That's typically the best way for me to get the diamonds that I've been I've been so needing. I'm gonna go ahead and make a few more of these walls. 300 should be good. Combine that stack so we don't accidentally start making white walls. That would throw off the entire design here. Not that I am anywhere near as fancy of a designer as I would like to have been, but I'm trying. It counts for something, right? <laughs> Let me see if I can at least fill in this gap over here. It's going to get really, really dark in the house. Oh god, is it going to get really dark in here? Can I, can I even finish this? Do I have enough? Maybe. Colored outside the lines. Damn it, smart cursor! This is why we can't have nice things. There it is. It's so dark in here now. Turn smart cursor off, so we don't want that. Alright. I need to go get some sand. Let's go get some sand and get some gem spark blocks going. So I can finish this off. And then I think I'll take the obsidian that I have in this chest to make the pillars. And then that's going to be done. That's going to be done. 
it's coming together. You get out of here, sir. That's that's a big fall for you. I really hope you have a horseshoe. Lucky bastard. <laughs> Lucky bastard NPCs don't take damage. Go ahead and deposit a lot of the junk. And I don't need that. I got a zombie arm. Get out of here. So Topaz blocks. Well, I don't like you. Get out of my inventory. Let's take the bombs that we have. Let's go get some sand. And we're gonna need that for the glass for our gem spark blocks. I can't believe the topaz just looked that bad. It looked like pee on the wall, man. <laughs> it was not pretty at all. I just took fall damage because of that. I'm glad I jumped when I hit the end. Uh, I'll go ahead and take this lead ore because we actually really do need it. So let's 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 do that. I don't feel bad about doing that. Get rid of the dirt. I should also bring a bunch of dirt from home and, <laughs> and go fill in the turd. We're gonna have to work on that again here shortly. Let's see here. Bomb time. Go ahead and put that where the walls are. Antlion, get out of here. Beat you up. I don't like you. Is that going to be the bone snake thingy, or is it just going to be a worm? I can hear it to my right. It keeps making that noise, but it's not spawning. I think it's getting a little bit closer. I hate when the worms do this. They do this all the time. They act like they're coming after you, then they stop. Is that tin down there? Darn. I need lead. So again, we need lead for my chest. That's my big limiting factor at the moment. Can I can I get a bomb here? Nope. Well, now we can. Make a sticky bomb. <laughs> I should just make a bunch of I should just made a bunch of sticky bombs to begin with. And let's see how much sand I get after this. I don't feel like spamming any more of these. Fifty reds it only it only took uh, this many episodes to get fifty red slimes. Jeez. The slimes are apparently more rare than I thought. Oh, you stop going inv invincible. I will kill you, sir. Okay, how much sand do I have? 500. That ought to get me everything I need. As long as I don't make a bunch of, of stupid, ugly walls like I did last time. So I have emeralds left. Thank you. And go ahead and hit the hammer. Let's see. Gem spark walls. Sorry, need to be over here. Where are they? Uh, where are they? You know what? I'm just going to go ahead and open the chest like this. Take the emerald out. Bam. Oh, I don't have glass. Derp. Derp. Derp, derp, derp. Spam all the glass. Bye-bye, sand. I don't need you. And drip perk walls. I saw you. There they are. Man, there's a, there's a bunch I can make, but uh, I've been liking the green one so far. 40 might be enough. So before I spam them all and waste my glass like I like I did last time, let's hold off. Let's hold off for now. Let's go see how far I can get with what I have. I don't want to go too far. It's just, it's just silly. Get the bombs off my hot bar. That's a bad idea. So let's fill these in. These have been, these have been very pretty. I, I am pleasantly surprised at their aesthetic. So I have ten left. I, I need more, but there's a crafting bench over here. I can whip some together. Man, you go through these very quickly. Just, and I'm just using them as accents. I'm not even like making things out of them. That's ridiculous. I make one more batch. Cause that'll get me what I need. All right, so the walls are done there, unless I want to do something else above. So what I need to figure out, am, am I committing to little compartmentalized NPC houses? I, I feel like I am. I feel like I am. Also, I'm going to do this. Just to smooth things out here. It's starting to look like a giant penis again, but I'm just trying to smooth things off. Do I like that at all? Not really. Nah, doesn't look as well as I thought it did. Don't know. I'll have to figure that one out later. Now, NPC rooms. If we're going to do that, we're going to need platforms up. How am I going to get up if I'm going to have these mannequins everywhere? That needs to be decided upon. Let's uh, go ahead and make more uh, boreal wood blocks, boreal wood walls. Just use my remaining boreal wood. Okay, equip the paint sprayer. And I'm going to run out of paint here. I don't have that much black paint. I have 500 something. Let me see what I can fill in here. Give me an idea of what we're working with. Give me an idea of what I'm working with. Come on. Uh, can I reach? Score. So 400. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I do think I want the NPCs up. Some of them. The majority of them. Near my house. I think it might be annoying trying to get to them all if they're in their own little, little place. And plus, having them killing the slimes for me constantly... Is probably going to be very nice. 
if I have to keep dealing with those guys when I'm looking in chests and stuff, I don't think I'm going to like having having that problem. I mean, I like having gold brung to me. I mean, look at all the gold that's just sitting around. <laughs> but it'll probably get annoying really fast. Okay, I have 800, 180 paint. I said 800. I don't have that much paint. I wish I did. I have to go buy some, but just pay attention here. Is there anything missing in these places? There was something there. Okay, I'm just making sure I have no dead spots. 100 paint left. We're nearing the end. We're nearing the end, folks. 50, 40, 30, 20. I don't have that much wall. No, I don't have that many walls left to work with. All right, so we're officially out of that. There's a pinky up there. I will go ahead and butcher his ass. Is pinky a girl? I don't know. And before, yep, and before ridiculous knockback. <laughs> pinky. Instead of flying using a, the Phoenix Blaster. So yeah, Pinky's always worth the kill. Free cash. You can never have too many currencies. Too many currencies in your inventories. Alright. Water bolt's bouncing back like a boss. Yep, we need white torches. That's moral of the freaking story. So storage is definitely looking better, but I need, I need to get iron and lead. This world only has lead. So, what I think I'll do now... Oh shit, painting things again. <laughs> a red slime banner that's white. Derp. So what I think I'll do is actually why don't we why don't we go down to the underworld now? And while I'm down there, I will loot the chest, I'll kill things. I'm gonna work on an arena which is gonna require a lot of wood. And because I mean right now I let me actually just make sure I quick stack, not deposit it all. Okay, I don't need gold bricks. These are building materials. Let me just put all my building materials in here before I start yammering on my plans. I want to make mistakes here. I want to summon you. Do I not have pink gel in you? I thought I did. Well, I'm going to put pink gel in you for now. Just get rid of the bomb. Oh, well, rest in pieces. I fucking hate bomb fish. I fucking hate having bombs in my inventory. I always do this. At least nothing bad broke. Damn it. Okay. Get rid of the zombie banner. Let me just clean up my inventory. Okay, so I'm thinking about going down into the underworld, maybe just starting the the arena to break things up. It's going to require, again, a lot of wood. Now, what we have to do, my knowledge of the way the wall of flesh is going to work, this, where I'm at, is kind of the center point. Where my house is is basically more center. So if I'm far over on the right and I throw the, the voodoo doll into the pit of lava, he should spawn to my right because I'm on the right side, and it gives you, I, I think, that's how it works. I think he always spawns on the right. So he'll come at me from here and push me left, and then I can have a bunch of platforms this way. The same applies in opposite, vice versa. Like, so if I'm over on the left, he should come from the left and then push me right. So I should be able to just make one really long platform this way and summon him over and fight him on my way back. Um, that should work. But I want to go ahead and... Do I want to pull all my stuff from home yet? Maybe not. I think we can do that early hard mode. I don't think it's going to be too much of a problem. I just got to be careful. I really just want to... I'm trying to do a pleasant balance between building and combat, and obviously it's not easy when you're making a fancy house. So, before I do that, there is this sword shrine here that could have something that'll help me kill the wall of flesh. I'm not going to kill the wall of flesh right now. I'm just starting the arena. But if I can get... It's, it's a sword? It's like a magic sword, I think? I need to look into it more. It's like Arcellus or something like that. I'm not, I'm butchering the name. But you get it from the Sword Shrine. And we've actually found quite a few of them in this world. Or actually, no, in the worlds when we were looking for pyramids, I found a few of those shrines. None of them had what we needed, of course, because Terraria and Atara and G. But apparently it's a very, very strong item. And I would like to get it, but I'm not holding out. Iron Jesus hates me. I'm going to go try, though. <laughs> Can't say I didn't try. I mean, get wrecked. Got hit from all the way back there. There's some more lead, right? Nope. That's stone. I'm stupid. I have my eyes out right now for lead. We, we need lead for my chests. Pick up some fallen stars, because why the heck not? And it was right past the jungle, right? Actually, it's right past where the pyramid was. Okay, so once we come across the pyramid, then I need to pay attention. There's a little hole in the ground, and that's where we need to dig our way down, and that's where the uh, little sword shrine thing is. And you just break it, and apparently it has a chance to drop. I have broken quite a few and just not gotten lucky. All this ultra bright torch, you guys can see everything. 
everything. It's so bright. <laughs> if only the light it emitted was more white, I, I would I would use it more often. I don't like the the bluish tinge it gives. Eh, Giving them fallen stars. Yum. So many fallen stars. How many do I have in my inventory right now? Four. Figured I have more than that. Okay, so there's the meteorite from earlier. <laughs> And we're coming, we're coming close here, guys. It's right past the corruption, and then the pyramids there, and we're where, need, where we need to be. Moment of truth: Can I get the item I'm looking for? I hear this thing is like a really good item, and I really want to have it. There's our pyramid. Can't believe we got a pyramid in this world. I was genuinely surprised. So it's right here on the map, top right. You're seeing my mouse cursor. It's right down here. This is the little short sword shrine thingy, and you can see. It's got, it's got like the, it's got a sword on it, and you just break it, and I'm supposedly supposed to have a chance of getting it. Can't. Oh my God, you're fucking kidding me. Is this it? Unless this is a different thing. I, I, to, I think there's two possibilities. I think I got shafted. This is the enchanted sword. It obviously has crap damage compared to Knight's Edge, but it shoots that little beam. So the beam's cool, but that's not. You can hold click this thing, which is actually pretty sweet. But no, this isn't the. That's not the super rare magic item that I wanted. Damn it! We got lucky, but we got unlucky. What's it? What's down here? Damn it! It sucks. It makes me want it all the more. There's some lead over there. What's over here? Nothing. It's down there. Just a blink root and a boomerang potion, or boomerang potion, boomerang statue. So enchanted sword. That's a really good item to get early game. It does 25 damage, and it shoots beams, so it's like a range weapon. Would have been nice to got earlier, but right now, no. It does me zero good. <laughs> Damn. Let's teleport home. Hang our heads in shame. Go ahead and get rid of a lot of this stuff. Quick stack our junk. Ultra bright torch. I just go ahead and put you back in my piggy bank. It's just kind of where you've been this whole time. Okay, I should put the pa I should put the paint away. I should put that away. Lead ore. I don't even have any lead ore in here, do I? Nope. That's why I didn't quick stack. So enchanted sword is not the that magical sword that I am looking for. Balls. Alright, let's uh let's go down to the underworld and maybe start working on this little little platform thing. Holy worms, Batman. There's like three of them right there. Let's <laughs> before I go down to the underworld, let me drop off the stuff because we're gonna want inventory space. And I still need to work on the little elevator here. There's just there's so much involved when you're making a fancy ass house. I mean this isn't even good. But, yeah, there's, there's a lot of work involved, so it takes time. So boreal wood walls can stay here. I genuinely do not need ropes at this stage in the game. And I can go ahead and get rid of the water leaf seeds. Yeah, it's raining. I'll go ahead and harvest this. Okay, I swear we're going to go down the underworld. Don't worry. It's going to happen. It's going to happen. <laughs> it will happen. And go ahead and do my placeholders. Okay, so this chest is finally completed. All right, we're good to go. I have 800 some wood, so we can make as many platforms as I need. You just go ahead and make a big stack of them right now. That should be a healthy start. You want to give yourself more room than, than not, because if you run out of platforms and you're still fighting him, you're going to have a bad day. You're going to have a bad day. Get the fuck out of my way. <laughs> kept pushing me back. I don't have my Shield of Cthulhu, or Shield of Cthulhu, Obsidian Shield equipped at the moment, just because I've been using the bundle of balloons. Might be a good idea to use the shield down here, but we're going to be dealing with a lot of lava. So being able to jump around is really good. Either way, let's start working on the platform just so I can show you guys what, what we're going to be dealing with later on. Oops. And there's some slush. So, I mean, we could definitely come back here later on and get a bunch of slush. That's, that's going to be the best way, I think, for me to find diamonds. As long as we've been mining, we've only found like 10 diamonds. And I think most of that actually came from <laughs> came from the extractinator. Just not getting lucky. I get more gold than I get like diamonds and shit. Oh man. All right, so we're down here. A lot of this lava, I think, is yeah, obsidian because we let water through, right? That should be the case. So I do want to have like easy oh, uh, easy ways to get through all this stuff. So if I were to fight the eye or the wall. I should be able to find my way through like these little towers. So just have like entrances. So dig the walls out. 
But most of that's going to come with when I make my arena. Go ahead and open this door. And open that door. So those are entrances. Now, where do we want to start? How far are we going over to the right? Shadow key. Well, a good thing I happen to have this with a shadow key in it, right? <laughs> yes. So, Flame Leash is pretty bad. To my knowledge. If there's anything potion, I might use while I'm down here. Go ahead and pick up that chest. So, Flame Leash. I think it's a magic missile. Yep. Basically upgraded magic missile. Poke. It's not the greatest. It's not the worst. Not really something you're going to want to rely on, though. Okay. And this thing, Phoenix Blaster, holds its own down here for sure. So I'll be using a lot of that. But let's continue to go on. And if I come across a shadow chest or two, I will open them up. Get out of my way, sir. I could probably just use a Spelunker push to make sure I do see them, but... We'll get them if we, if we need to later on. My opinion, shadow chests, the loot in them, it's kind of mediocre. It really is. That saddens me. There's just not not that much good stuff in a shadow chest. The only thing... What's what's the only thing that I really liked out of it? I think it was one time, like, super... The only time I've ever actually had it useful was, like, early game. I got a spear out of it. I can't remember what it was, like, a purple spear... And that was pretty good. But then I like I replaced it like right away. I don't know. The stuff you find in it's pretty mediocre. Alright, I see you, Mr. Guide Voodoo Demon. If you would like to come into this building and have me kill you, that would be cool. Okay, I don't want you to fall in the lava. Come on, sir. Come on. Here, sticky dynamite. Damn. I wanted to land it here so it would come through here. Oh, he's coming. Come on, get in here. Get in the building. Yeah. No, no, no. Don't push him out that way. Okay. The water bolt was knocking him towards the lava. The last thing we need is ha to have him drop that in the lava. So what I'm doing is I'm pushing far to the right because we need to start our arena far out and then work our way in. Go ahead and uh, kill you, sir. Go in, serpent. Die. Down you go. Water bolt. OP. That's new. I think that's new. Inferno potions are also new. 1.3 to my knowledge. So that's actually okay. It looks like it may have changed the, the loot tables a little bit. So let's see. It doesn't do a lot of damage compared to what I have already, but wooden, wooden arrows turn into flaming bats. So that sounds pretty cool. I don't have any wood arrows at the moment. So I'll hang on to them. That's pretty cool, I guess. It's kind of like the, the other bow. I was using the bee bow, the bee's knees. Turning wooden arrows into bees. wonder how well that's going to work. Hey, if they buff those, if they buff those chests, that's cool. They definitely deserved it. They they were pretty poopy, in my opinion. Another shadow chest, cool. Let, let the lava go through here. That's it. Come on, come on. There can't be that much lava in that block. All right, what do we got? Also, dresser. Do you have loot? No, no loot in here. What have you got? There it is. That's what it was. The dark lance. It's it's kind of bad, but I had it one time. And it was really good. It can segment enemies because because it's, it's a spear. Lesser restoration potion is pretty useful. I had to loot that stuff. So uh, the, the the bow that's cool. It's new to me. I I want to test this thing out. Hey, have you got wooden arrows? You got gold. You got gold for sure. Give me that gold. Fifteen gold. Oh my god! I like breaking pots. It's ridiculous. Man, I'm taking a shit ton of damage. I gotta be careful. Oh, I think it's. I think I'm getting burnt. Yeah, I think that's what's doing it. So look at my health. Yeah, I'm... Uh, what is this? Burning. Losing life and slowed movement? I'm dying. <laughs> I tried to teleport. What was killing me there? I didn't touch the slime, did I? The bat may have set me on fire. Is it... Is it because I'm touching the hellstone brick and I don't have... Oh, maybe that's it. Maybe that's it. Hold on. Let's try this. Let's try this. Let me quick sack some stuff here. Let me bring an obsidian skull... And see if that's what it was. I think it's what it was. Do I not have one? Thought I did. I'm pretty sure I made another one. There it is. Let's bring that. Uh, you know, I could, I could also just say screw it to the bundle of balloons. Let's go ahead and do that. I think that's my issue. So let's go get our gold back real quick here. Let me just get rid of this. Uh, I'll drop off. I noticed that earlier. I was getting hit by a lot of stuff, and I had no idea what it was. I'll drop off some of this loot. 
All right, let's go back down. I want to go get my gold real quick. It's 20 gold. I don't feel like losing. So I think it was because of I was standing on those bricks. I didn't know that they did fire damage. I genuinely did not know that. Let's go test it. I want to verify that. Damn it. That sucks. That's embarrassing. Let me uh, actually get off of the rope so I can use the torch. Damn it. I don't have to say to that. <laughs> I noticed like I was taking a lot of damage. Like I was being ticked five repeatedly for a long time. But, I, but I'm like, I'm not touching anything. Was I on fire? And then I would look up to see my debuffs. And I would notice I was on fire, but it would like wear off. So I'm like, it must have been a fire bat or something. No, I think it's because I was touching stuff I shouldn't have been touching. Let's let's verify this. Come on. Get your ass down here. I should have brought the slime mount, but I have my B. Bring use your slime mount, you go down so fast. Oh, it's ridiculous. Hey buddy, you're kinda trapped in there. Alright. Traveling merchant, I don't really care about you, sir. Let's test this. Let's go over one of these buildings. I don't think these do it. This is just obsidian. Like, if I were to take the shield off, I'm not taking five damage ticks. That lava's looking menacing. Let's be careful. So I'm not taking damage here. I think it was just on the other hellstone. Because those were hellstone bricks, right? weren't they? Uh, maybe I was touching actual hellstone blocks. Oh, no. I, I, I just want to check this really quick. I want to figure this out. That's bugging me. Uh, how far did I go? Let's check here on the map. Not that much farther. Mainly I just want to get my gold. <laughs> okay, so this is still obsidian. And I wasn't taking damage back here, no. I'm still not on fire, but then again I have the obsidian shield. I don't have my bundle of balloons. I have to be careful I don't have all those jumps that I'm used to. And... Okay, here's the room where I died. Now let's see. Obsidian shield working. Yep, that's what it was. Okay, didn't know. Now I know. I don't think that used to do that. That could be wrong. Golden grape marker. Eh, just get rid of it. So I don't remember that doing that before. Well, now I know to bring an obsidian shield with you. <laughs> okay. Makes sense. You are dead. Okay, you, you were very close to being dead. You have 65 HP. You are an embarrassment. Alright, I'm just not going to kill that slime. I don't feel like having lava spill out everywhere. Poke. Right in his butt. Alright, kill a fire imp. And this is... This is all annoyances that I have to deal with when I start making my arena backwards. So let's just be careful we don't have the bundle of balloons. Can't jump a lot. And there's still buildings over here. You can, you will actually run out of buildings at some point. They'll stop spawning. There's another shadow chest up there. There's, there's a surprising amount of shadow chests. I actually don't remember this many. There usually is only like four or five. At least in my experience. Hey, the more the merrier. I'm okay with this. What do we got? I don't want a feather fall potion. I do want to kill you. Come in the building, please. Nope. Nope. Water bolt. Don't do it. Don't kill him there. Okay, come over here. Just die on top of this platform. Okay, we're good. No, no voodoo dolls were uh, dropped in the lava. We're okay. Another flame leash. Just go ahead and loot it and take the chest. Water bolt! Water bolt, you shrug! Okay, so I'm going to wrap the episode up here, guys. This was uh, episode 73. Uh, a little bit of an embarrassing death there. I totally didn't even realize that... I was taking fire damage, but whatever. Next episode, I think what I'll do... Ooh, Magma Stone. I already have one, but nice. Uh, next episode, I will probably work on the Wall of Flesh Arena. I do still want to work on the house a bit. I mean, I'm just trying to break things up. I've been building for a long time. Uh, I, I need I need lead to make my chest. That's a fact. So we need to hold off. I can't do anything right now. Titan Potion. You were pretty good, if I remember. No, you're actually pretty useless. <laughs> just increases knockback. I think I'm thinking of Titan Armor from console versions of the game. Not that I've ever played it, but I read about it. Anyway, guys, let's wrap it up here. Episode 73. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Get out of here. No, no, get out of here. All right, we're good.